Assalamu alaikum friends and welcome to Pure Brain Joy. Jinns, which means ghosts. Jinn is an Arabic word used for spirits or ghosts. Many of you guys don't believe in jinns, but it's real even science believe them unwillingly. Allah Almighty also mentioned about jinns. Here is a small verse of Surah Adriat. And I create the jinn and mankind to worship me. It is heard from our forefathers that before the advent of humans, ghosts used to live in this world, and their number was so large that you can't even imagine. Even today, if there is no human settlement in a place, there must be ghosts there. When a house remains deserted for 40 days, the jinn must live there, and after that, if a person tries to stay there, the jinn will harass him and will not allow him to stay there. When we go there, they have trouble sleeping and wake up, and they feel very uncomfortable. They scare the humans to get out of there and do everything possible to get them to leave the place so that they can live their lives in peace. The jinn forbid these people to live and eventually, as a result, they are forced to leave their homes. Like humans, jinn are also the creation of Allah Almighty. They also live with their wives and children. They are afraid of the light and live in dark. They occupy dark places. They laugh with their children. Their children also play and jump like human children. There are also types in jinn too. There are good jinn and bad jinn. Good jinn are fond of friendship with humans. These jinn worship in masks with humans. They do not hurt anyone without reason and neither Allah has allowed them to hurt anyone for no reason. But Allah is very merciful. He prevents them from harassing us. If we act with courage and intellect, we can rule over all the creatures created by Allah. Allah has given us a beautiful gift in the form of the Holy Quran. Read it and understand it. That is the secret of ruling the whole world. If we start reading it with understanding, firstly, Allah will be pleased with us, and secondly, it will make us possess such powers that even jinns, Devils and even more dangerous creatures will fear us, but the condition is that we should follow the path given by Allah and his messenger. Jinns can take the form of any creature. Like animals, even humans, they can travel thousands of miles very comfortably and effortlessly. They can go anywhere in the world, and they can understand and speak all languages. They had extraordinary powers that are not even in human imagination. Their lifespan is thousands of years. Among the jinn, there are Muslim jinn and unbeliever jinn. The Muslim are the good ones and there are also sinner Muslim jinns. Their population is more than we can even imagine. Thus, the number of disbelieving jinn is also larger than we think. They can take the form of any creature. Humans does not have powers like jinns. But if you are righteous and pious servant of Allah, that Allah gives him superiority over all the creatures. The jinn and all creatures are subject to him. They are also called the Allah's friend or Wali Allah. If we want to become Wali Allah, then we must follow the path that Allah and his messenger told us and stay away from the things or limits that Allah forbids us. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure to subscribe, like, share and comment See you in the next video. Masalama.